Baseball Super Bowl is wrapped up today at Cranston Stadium. Yesterday was North Kingstown winning the D1 title, Central Falls taking the D3 crown. Today, Division II and Division IV championships, and what an emotional day for one one socket player. We start with the Villanovans taking on East Greenwich. Second quarter, EG trailing 13 0. Conrad Swanson rolling out, finds a lane. Dives in for the touchdown to make it a one score game. Right before the half, when Socket goes double reverse, Tariq Robinson O'Hagan finds his brother Dwayne. That would lead to a field goal. Novens up 16 to 7 at the break. More trick plays in the third. The pitch to running back Manny Gomes, and he'll throw it, finding Zach McIntyre in the end zone. When Socket, your D2 state champs, 37 13. All around effort, we had a great week of practice. We manned through the cold. Um, we knew we were gonna, if we executed to the game plan, we were going to do just fine. For these guys to band together and stick through it all year, it's, it's been remarkable. These are, it's a tough, tough group of kids. They're very close to each other, and it's just one big family, and I can't be more happy for them. And this one extra special for Novin's running back Emmanuel Gomes. Gomes' mother, Rena Flurry, died on August 31st after going into cardiac arrest while at the team's injury fund game. Emmanuel dedicated his senior season to her and ended his career with a championship today. He rushed for nearly 200 yards and two touchdowns to earn MVP honors. The kid's my hero. Um, he's the first one to practice. He's the last one to leave. Um, I think he uses this as his crutch to get away from everything. He loves the game of football. He loves being around his teammates. You'd probably be crying. You'd probably say about time you guys won. Because we never really won. First time we actually had a real winning season. So she would just be proud. We have her on the bench with us every week. Um, she would be so proud of him, so proud of the team, everybody. She wouldn't be proud of just Emmanuel. She'd be proud of everybody. Steve.